I know this is what you've all been waiting for. The results to last week's math test. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Funny thing is, Mr. Trotter actually thinks we look forward to it. Well, maybe one of us does. Martha's been the reigning math queen for the whole semester. As usual, Martha, an almost perfect score. 99.9%. I let that 0.1% slide so the other kids don't hate me. <sighs> Only one other student scored higher. What? 117%! Congratulations, Mikey! You achieved a mark so high, it's a mathematical impossibility! This is not happening. This is not happening. This is not happening! Oh, silly me! I almost forgot! This makes Mikey the undisputed math champion! No! Mr. Trotter, you can't! Without your hollow academic approval, I'm nothing! Martha, you, me, the Barkley Film Festival, it'll be a... Oh, whoa! <laughs> Was that a yes? Oh, yeah. She totally has the hots for you. got an email from your parents this morning. <clears throat> Dear kids, having a great time at Machu Picchu? Heard about Mikey's test? Fantastic. At least I'm still their favorite. Mikey is now our favorite. He deserves a double hug. Martha and Reggie should learn from his example. Love you all, but love Mikey best. <laughs> wow! That's like two hugs in one! I never get a double hug! Good job! Super work! That's it, Mikey. You're going down! It's like my lucky ZZ Hog Day! Steidiggers! Awesome! Swine Whiners! Cool! Like... Uh-oh. Hello, brother. Martha! I'm so glad to see you. Someone lured me here with an awesome set of records, then jumped me and tied me to this chair. Listen, you idiot. Did Mikey cheat on his algebra test? Huh? Even if I knew, I couldn't tell you. It's the sacred bond of trust between guys not to rat on each other. Even rats don't rat on other rats. Really? Well, as embarrassing as losing to that hick was, I'm sure it's only half as bad as what you're going to feel when I show your friends this. What if 
your band found out that you like slamming away to Hampy. Now, did Mikey cheat? Sis, I really don't know. If he cheated, he didn't tell me. You know I can't keep a secret. I can't even keep a girlfriend. Okay, Reg, let's try it this way. If Mikey was going to cheat, how would he do it? Okay, okay. The easiest way to cheat is to, like, get a copy of the test before you write it. That way you know all the answers. Reggie, you're some kind of idiot genius! He probably hacked into the school computers and stole the test! I need to get into Mikey's computer. Hello? Martha? I'm chafing here! I'm going in. Now, if I was a big geek, which I am so not, where would I hide test answers? You are not an authorized user. Huh? Oh, real mature, Mikey. That does not compute. You must leave the system now. Figures. Hey, look! It's a computer virus! I do not see a computer virus. Don't quit your day job, honey. Like candy from a baby. <gasps> a baby with a triple encrypted 128-bit two-tiered password? I'm going to need some outside help. Fine, I'm going. It's against the sacred hacker code. I can't sell out my fellow renegades. I've always been number one. And now Mikey comes along and takes everything away from me. Martha, you've always been number one to me. Really? You'll help poor little me? Uh, oh. Oh. This worm program cracks through security like it's making an omelet. Oh, thanks, Brian. You're really sweet. For a total geek. Uh, while you're here, I was wondering if you'd like to go to the film festival. With me? Password accepted. Welcome, Mikey. <laughs> You have no new mail. Ha! Loser! Now just open his personal account and... Personal diary entry, April 5th. Huh? I can't believe it. Betty Carbonara looked at me in class. It was like the light of heaven beaming down on me. She's such a super vixen. Huh? I'd die if anyone found out. You can have your 117%, Mikey. I've got something far, far better. So, did Martha agree to go to the film fest with you? Um, not exactly. She looks happy. That's why I'm worried. You'll never guess what I have. A uh, disc? Yeah, but what's on the disc? I don't know. It's someone's personal diary filled with someone's super personal embarrassing stuff? <laughs> oh, wow. It would suck to be them. <laughs> 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 it's yours, you moron! Huh? No way. My computer's locked up tighter than Pig Capone's vault. Not even E. Brian could crack my codes. <laughs> oh, yeah? Does this sound familiar? 
It was like the light of heaven beaming down on me. She's such a super vixen. Wow! You didn't! I did. And I'm going to post it on the school website. Unless you make up for beating me in algebra by becoming my slave. If my diary gets out, any chance I ever had with Betty Carbonara goes up in smoke. This is bad. Really bad. Stop stalling, Lardo! Fine. I'll be your slave for one day. Pshaw! Try one week. And if I hear a peep of complaint from you, it's light of heaven time for Betty. Meet me after school, slave. We're going shopping. Ouch! How did she get past my security? It was hack-proof. Uh, no idea. <laughs> Maybe it was a, a fluke. Ooh. And isn't this nice? It's from France. Hmm, it's a three, just my size. Maybe your shoe size. And who asked you? Oh, wait, no one. If anybody sees me, I'm gonna die. This is a strictly no guy zone. You're overreacting. Just one more tiny little thing left. Buy them. What? No way! That's fine. I can respect your principles. It would be a shame if your diary appeared in the video yearbook, that's all. I have seen the face of evil. Its name is Martha. Psst! <sighs> can I help you? I want to... Um... I mean, I have to... Uh, I, I, I want to... Oh, I want to buy this underwear! I see. <laughs> Will that be all, sir? You don't happen to sell any uh, uh, dignity here, do you? <laughs> uh, no. What are you doing in my locker? Some older, sports-oriented schoolmates apparently thought it would be quite the joke to see if I fit. Apparently I do. <laughs> huh? But since I do have your attention, I thought I might plead on Mikey's behalf. It's time to give back his diary. Hasn't he suffered enough? <gasps> Bad chance! I'm on a pretty sweet ride here, and there's no way I'm getting off now. Well... I didn't want it to come to this, but if you don't let Mikey go, I'll... I'll... you what? Tell your parents, or at least their assistants. You're not going to tell anyone anything. Or Mikey's going to find out who helped me hack his computer. And in case you've forgotten, that was you. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Chemistry 101. I believe that's on the third floor. <sighs> right away, ma'am. <laughs> She's an animal. Dude, we've got to help Mikey out. Martha's playing him like a hollow body six string. I know. My guilt is eating me up from the inside. Ooh. What happened to you? Martha couldn't make it, so I had to go to her 12.30 with Rosie. She gave me a full body wax. Even my bikini line. Oh. That doesn't even make sense. Yeah, that sucks, man. Ah! Whoa! Whoa! Mikey, I've got something to confess. I gave Martha the program that... Let her crack your security. I'd strangle you, but the friction would kill me. Then, dude, you should strangle me, too. I gave her the idea of looking in your computer. Can you ever forgive us? Nope, never. Hm. Unless you help me get out of this mess. But how? Martha's a blackmailing monster. We have to get my disc back. 
Oh, right after I grow some hair. Brian, what's her status? She's in deep sleep REM stage four. Go, go, go! A guitar string? Will this even hold my weight? Unless you weigh more than rock and roll, you've got nothing to worry about. Trotley grew! Guitar solo! Frankie, the string! The string! Hold on, it's almost over! Phew. Pull me up! She's still asleep. Mission accomplished! <laughs> Check it, E. Let's do it again! But this time, I want to go down on the string. Hello, chumps. If you're watching this, it means you tried to steal the disc back. Suckers! And Mikey, we're trying to squirm out of our little arrangement. It's going to be another month before you're thinking for yourself. Ha! <laughs> huh? No! No? Are you defying me? You bet! I won't be your lackey anymore! Fine, I can live with that. You can? As long as you can live with the fact that everyone at school is going to learn your deepest, darkest secrets. I'm entering your little diary into the Barclay Film Festival. <laughs> no! <laughs> Come on, dude. It's for your own good. <sighs> You're gonna have to face the music sometime. Uh, May as well get it over with. What about my last meal? Can I at least have a blindfold? Just in time. I wouldn't have missed this for the world. You should be very proud, Martha. It's a very touching confessional piece. It moved me. What? We're talking about the same video, aren't we? The one with Mikey, the dork? I love the part where he said he admired you for opening your heart and your house to a stranger. He said that? How dare he be nice to me? Especially now! That pig has a soft spot for you. What have I done? I gotta stop the showstopper before it stops the show! God, if you have any mercy, strike me down now. Don't worry. There's, like, nobody watching. Okay, so there's, like, a couple. Stop that film! Pigabonga! Huh? Oh. <laughs> made it. Diary entry. Number 18. Today was a great day. <gasps> No way, Fruitcake! You mess with this projector, you mess with the whole audio-visual club! I can't find Mr. Snuggles anywhere. How can I sleep without my teddy bear? Oh, no! Mikey! <laughs> Betty Carbonara smiled at me today. I thought I would die. She's gotta be the hottest chick on the planet. 
She's the queen of babes. She's the empress of hotties everywhere. Huh? It appears that the film was well received. Dude, they loved it. I never knew you were so sensitive, Mikey. And honest. And funny. <laughs> Call me. Oh. Ahem. Uh. Uh, Betty. I can explain. I mean, I, uh. I never meant for, um... That was very sweet, Mikey. <laughs> Big dude! I know. Mikey, I'm so sorry. I'll understand if you never want to speak to me again. I won't like it, but I'll understand. I'd do anything to make it up to you. Hey, don't worry. It's all cool. I deserve that. Wait! It's cool? Absolutely. E. Brian? I'd do anything to make it up to you. You can start with breakfast in bed tomorrow. I like my eggs sunny side up, not runny. OJ and white toast. Got it? Then you can carry my books, vacuum my room, my nose hairs need a trim. Oh, and write, Mikey didn't cheat a thousand times. <laughs>